Aloha, my name is Cindy Mayo Davis and welcome to MauiToday.tv. I'm here with the What's Up Maui segment and we're here asking people with the question on what they feel about the Super Ferry. Well, I actually hope that it would come to the Big Island because that's where I'm from and um, I, I really don't understand what the whole problem is with, uh, with everybody and not wanting to, to go with the, the future and seeing all this um, progress because it's going to make a major impact. Right now, our infrastructure, as far as our highways, are not, are not there for the traffic. I mean, you know, I work for the fire department, so it's, you know, if there's going to get even more traffic and it's going to even get harder to get on the road and get to people who need help. I don't think it's good. I don't know. It's, it's a lot. It's expensive. I mean, it's about the same price if you rent a car over in Oahu to go there. So I don't think it's good. And plus, it's ruining the whales. Oh, the super ferry. Oh. Long question short, um, was that it kind of junk that Super Ferry went down because, well, look at the cruise ship. Nobody grumbling about the cruise ship, and they grumble about the Super Ferry. It's more easier and it's cheaper for people. Like us Hawaiians nowadays, hard for get jobs, so kind of junk. And the Super Ferry, <laughs> what's my opinion? Really want to know opinion? Yes. Oh, uh, I think it's a good idea, but what I can understand is, you know. The uh, people that are stopping it, how come they don't stop the cruise ships coming in? Why the super ferry? Why pick on the super ferry? Uh, I'm concerned with the possibility of invasive seaweeds coming over. Someone that put their boat in the water on Oahu and may have some sprigs of it on their vehicle, which are easily transplanted into our waters. And they have forms there that have no natural predators and they grow extremely fast. They smother the coral by knocking out the sunlight. And I'm concerned about the possibility of increased drugs coming in and possibly stolen merchandise because of the drug problem on Maui. I think it's a really big shame that they went through the trouble of making it all and spent millions and millions of dollars of making it all. I don't know where they got the money, but I'm sure some of it might have come from taxes. And after they made it all, then we decided that we couldn't use it. It just seems extremely backwards and a waste of a lot of people's time and effort. We need the progress, we need the jobs, we need to keep our children here in Hawaii, we need to support the, the younger generation, and hopefully we can do that by having these kind of jobs like the Super Ferry. I personally don't think it's a good idea. I think traveling on the airplane works just fine, shipping cars over that way is just as cheap if not cheaper, and I think it's not that great because the EMI was um, just skipped, which is probably something that should have been done. The environment is really important and money is just like so important to everyone and they're forgetting about what we're really living for, which is nature and the good things in life. My opinion on the Super Ferry? I don't have an opinion on the Super Ferry. You don't have an opinion? I don't have an opinion. <laughs> I don't have enough facts on, on what's really going on with the Super Ferry to have an opinion. Thank you everyone for joining me with What's Up Maui. I'm Cindy Mayo Davis with MauiToday.tv. Mahalo and ahui ho. Maui Today.